Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Ken Tomash, in for Don Evans on this Tuesday midday. In baseball, many are accused, but few are apprehended. That is, until last night, anyway. We're talking about scuffing or doctoring the baseball, that time-honored tradition of the game that, nonetheless, is still illegal. We'll try telling that to Minnesota Twins knuckleballer Joe Necro. In the fourth last night at Anaheim, he gets a called strike past California's Brian Downing, and home plate up Tim Tashita first wants to see the baseball, and then he wants to check out Necro's glove. He thinks there's something funny going on here. Well, they don't find anything in the glove, but then they make him empty out his pockets and watch Joe Necro's right pocket. Oh, what was that that fell on the ground? It turns out a five inch long emery board. Necro was scuffing up the baseballs. He was immediately ejected, and he now faces a 10 day suspension for doctoring up the baseball. Oh, by the way, the Twins won the game 11 to three. Other American League scores, Seattle 4-3 over Oakland. Tom Candiotti one hit the Yankees. Cleveland wins at 2-0. Toronto bombed the White Sox 14-5. In 10, it was KC over Detroit 4-2. And the Red Sox held off the Rangers 11-2. In the National League, Keith Hernandez's solo homer with two out in the bottom of the 11th gave the Mets a 3-2 win over Philadelphia and put New York into second place in the East now. Six and a half games behind the St. Louis Cardinals who pushed Montreal into third place with a 5-3 win over the Expos. Mike Marshall had a grand slam and five RBIs to lead the Dodgers over Cincinnati 7-2. Kevin Bassett, one homer right-handed and one left-handed. The right-handed one came in the 13th and brought Houston a 5-3 win over San Francisco and Pittsburgh dropped the Cubs 6-4. And that is a midday look at sports.